everyone, my name is Rama from the King Township Public Library and today we are going to be making 3D rainbows. I cannot wait to show you how I've made my 3D rainbow. We will be cutting out strips of colorful paper to make our rainbow and we will be cutting out a cloud and on the cloud we will be writing what we would do if we found a pot of gold. So I think if I found a pot of gold, I would maybe take a trip to somewhere nice and warm because it's really, really cold right now. So I would definitely do that. And I would maybe buy all the candy in the world because I love, love, love candy. So yeah, stay tuned and let's get started. So to start, we would need some colorful paper um, and a sky blue paper a white paper and black paper, some scissors, some glue, some clear tape, a pencil, a ruler, and I picked up these two cute little gold coins. You can use pennies if you have them at home or anything, but I thought these were cute as well. So let's begin. Okay, so to first we're going to start by drawing and cutting our rainbow strips. So I'm going to take my ruler and I'm going to measure about 2.5 centimeters in width and I'm going to mark it on the paper and honestly this doesn't have to be exact just around there and I'm going to draw my line oh sorry I'm with my ruler trying to be as straight as I can and go all the way down to the sheet the end of the sheet of paper and that's my first strip. I'm going to continue this for all the other colors on the paper until I have my rainbow colors. Okay. So now that we have all our beautiful colorful strips, I'm going to take all my strips, hold them in my hand like this, and make sure they're all somewhat aligned to all the ends, and I'm going to take a piece of tape. about this size and I'm going to tape it right about here in the bottom left corner of the page like that okay so now that that's all taped I drew an outline of my pot of gold with the black paper so you can do any shape um, and make sure it's a good enough size that it fits nicely on the paper. I'm going to take my glue and I'm going to glue the pot onto the paper. So I've got a good amount of glue here. All right, and I'm going to put it right here. And there we go. I'm going to take the first two strips and we're going to hold it like this and we are going to bend them. We're going to bend them like this, make sure that they're together. Maybe put that here. And I'm going to take a piece of tape and I'm going to tape it again together like that. So that's the first layer of the rainbow. And then I'm going to grab the next two strips. So this beautiful yellow color, 
Yellow is one of my favorite colors. And I'm just trying to see how I can put this here. Maybe put this like this. And I'll grab my tape and put it like that. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and take our last two colors, the purple and the blue, and I'm gonna hide the yellow too much. So I'm going to see if we can cross it, but bring the yellow out a bit more. And just tape it at the end like this. And there we go. Okay, so I have cut out my cloud. You can do any shaped cloud you want. I just made sure that the cloud and the pot of gold was sort of matching in size because when I put it on the page, I kind of want it all to look proportionate to the page as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and write, if I had a pot of gold, I would. All right, so I'm gonna start writing, if I had a pot of gold, I would, and do a dot, dot, dot. All right, and now you can write, if you had a pot of gold, what you would do, and then you would write it right underneath here. And then once you're done, you can flip it over and glue it. And we're going to glue it right and there we go all right so this is our 3d rainbow and to finish it off i have two gold coins here and i've just kind of double taped both of them and i'm going to stick it right here and right here just to kind of finish it off and it looks like an actual pot of gold. Okay, now we have completed our 3D rainbow. So that's how it looks. I hope you guys enjoyed doing this as much as I did. I think it looks super, super cool. You can always add glitter. You can always draw a sun in the background. You can do so many things with this craft. Um, and make sure you do write that if you did have a pot of gold, what you would do. Um, thank you for joining in and please join me again next time for another fun craft. Bye!